Now, this is a case, obstructive case, pregnancy test is positive. We are seeing the urinary bladder in transfer section. This is the urinary bladder in transfer section moving into longitudinal. This is the uterus. This is the uterus. And you see two cystic areas. One close to, uh, this is the one that is closer to the os. This is the internal os. This is the cervix. And uh, here is the, this is sac number one, gestational sac. And this is closer to the os. This is the cervix. So this is gestational sac number one. This is the urinary bladder. And as I go towards the fundal region, you get the other one. This is the uh, second uh, uh, sac. So this is a in fact, uh, very early twin pregnancy. This is the total length of the uterus in longitudinal section with two cystic areas with uh, ecogenic uh, rim around. And if you concentrate on the on this one, the sac number two, this one, it has in, it is full of internal echoes is suggestive of fleet and the other Im important thing is that the gestational sac measures uh, 36 millimeter now any gestational sac that you see measures more than 25 millimeters uh, and with, with the no fetal pole or embryo seen with them is uh, a case of an embryonic uh, pregnancy or uh, uh, more <coughs> an embryonic pregnancy or blight and rogo. <coughs> now this is sac number one. This is number two closer to the fundus. Here the rim is thin and there is no uh, significant blood flow to the trophoblastic direction. Here down, this one where I am placing the box is uh, gestational sac number one. Again, we do not see any fetal pole. What you are seeing here, don't mistake it with the fetal pole. This is all debris as we saw in this uh, second fetal pole, uh, uh, gestational sac. So this is gestational sac number two. And uh, now this sac measures approximately 2 point, uh, 27 millimeters. It's again more than 25 and inconsistent with an embryonic uh, pregnancy or blight and ovum. So this is a case of uh, early uh, pregnancy with the two gestational sacs, <coughs> no fetal pole seen, and both may have more than uh, 25 uh, millimeters. So this is a case of blightened uh, twin pregnancy, early twin pregnancy, uh, and embryonic, both showing no uh, fetal pose. This one shows echoes, this one shows echoes, this is the gestational sac number one, the two second, and both are separated, uh, separating each other. See it again. Thank you very much.